Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to Synthetic Oil Protection. I'm your host, Eben. Today on Synthetic Oil Protection, we're working on this 2018 Laramie 6.7 liter inline six turbo diesel. This is the 3500 heavy duty Ram. And today we're doing the motor oil change. If you're new to Synthetic Oil Protection, definitely consider subscribing by clicking the red icon in the corner or you just hit the little subscribe button right here and then you go ahead and tap the notification bell. And that way you'll get new notifications when my new video comes up. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put in our fuel injection cleaner. And this is a four-way product that does anti-gelling for cold driving uh, below freezing so the diesel fuel doesn't gel up. We're also doing the signature six times better on scuff testing uh, for the Detroit diesel industry standard. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to show you how many miles are on this beauty. Yeah, I got what? it. Yep, I got it. Because the window's sure going to come up. See, see this window? Yep. Okay. All right, guys. It's got 1,200 miles on it. And that's right. This is a brand spanking new truck. And we're going to do the oil change right now. Guys, but before we do the oil change, I want you guys to hear what it sounds like. So this engine has 1,200 miles on it. And listen to the way it sounds. Here it is. we're gonna put in our diesel all in one John's gonna be the administer go ahead John put her in this does four different things it does anti gel it also uh, does uh, diesel clean which cleans the uh, deposits out of the combustion chamber and it also has a lubricant which is proprietary and that lubricant actually protects your fuel injectors and it keeps the fuel injectors from getting scratched and uh, diesel fuel has a lot of scratchy particles in it and it actually wears out your injectors. So this lubricant really keeps your fuel system running smooth and it extends the life of the fuel filter. And it also has a cetane boost. So the added cetane will give more power as well. So it helps with startability and added oh, cetane. Yep. All, the way all right, all the way it's want. not going all the way down. So we have a little bit of a blunder. We need a longer We need a filter. longer uh, thing. Longer. We need to do a double penetration. So we had a small accident, but we'll fix it. <laughs> we know. No, we're gonna... All right, so John, uh, came, we have a way to get it in now. We have a long funnel to do a double penetration, and you need that because this bottle, the nose, the head of it, isn't long enough to get through both layers. So if you actually stick your finger in there, you're gonna feel two flaps, and you have to penetrate the second flap, and that's very common on the new uh, capless gas caps. Guys, we're taking off our oil filter first uh, just to make sure we know where it's at. So it's right in the front right wheel well and we have our oil filter wrench. This works really good. You may want to get a pipe that can slip over the back of this to get more leverage. Then we use the cloth here. The cloth allows the metal to squeeze against the filter better. So I'm going to show you guys where the filter is. The filter's right there. Our rubber's on for safety. Now all we do is just, just uh, take her off. Here we go. And there she goes. And there she released like butter. And now we're coming. There he goes. It's leaking right where She's it leaking be. right where it should be. Right. She's leaking down, and now I'm trying to get her with two finger, and we're coming out. We're coming, and we're stuck. We're stuck. We're trying to get her. My fingers are getting looser. I'm trying to trying to get her. My fingers are pinched. I'm trying to get her. See if I can slip her through. Squeeze her. And I think I'm going to need two hands. I'm going to need two hands, so I'm going to take the camera off. And this is a you sticky, hold, hold the camera? tight, tight, tight situation, guys. <laughs> and there I, it is. I think you're gonna. All right, that's it. Done. We go ahead and prep our AMS oil filter. 
This is our EAO filter, good for one year, 25,000 miles. And it filters at 98.7% efficiency at 20 microns. And the EMS oil filter comes all nice and sealed. Just go ahead and just crack her loose, take her out. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and lube up our, our... This is about six times better than the Detroit industry standard on uh, scuffing the cylinder lines. And this is our 5W40 we're putting in, 100% synthetic. And we're gonna go ahead and wet up our rubbers a little bit. And uh, we can't fill it all the way up because we gotta go through sideways. So we're gonna put a little bit in and we're gonna uh, turn her a little bit. We're gonna put about 20% in. And now we're gonna go ahead and wet her up with two finger. Go ahead and get your threads, hit your rubbers. As you guys know, the wetter the better. And now we're gonna rotate her a little bit. And this is gonna get it to saturate into the medium. And now we go ahead and thread her on. Guys, I just wanted to remark, this is the hardest one-handed thread on I've ever done. I put the filter back on one-handed. Basically, you come in here with the right hand and you have to thread it on with just one hand. So you can't use two hands through that hole. So it's all just right-handed and you gotta give it everything you got to get her in. All right, we're moving on. Guys, we got our dipstick out. We also have our, our cap off right here on the engine. And now it's time to go ahead and drain her done. Guys, we made it to the easy part. We got our 3 8 inch drive. And we just go ahead and crack her loose here. We already cracked her loose. It wasn't that tight from the factory at all. 35 pounds. Yep, that's it. Very light. And now, all we do is just go ahead and... If you can. I will... I'll, down to three. One, two, and a three. Good. Good move. Good move. Perfect. And there move. she blows. And move that back just a little bit in case it walks on you. Yep. Just a, just a hair. There you go. All right, guys. Check the plug for Take a any, look at the plug. Any, any uh, no metal good. on it, right? Nope. Looks good. Okay. All, All right. nice and clean. All right. Three eighth inch drive. All right. All right, guys. It's that time to put in our liquid gold. We're putting in our Amsoil Signature Series Diesel. It's our Max Duty, 100% synthetic. And uh, this outperforms six times the Detroit Diesel Cylinder Scuff Test. And uh, you'll see right here on Heavy Duty, you're good for uh, 60,000, 600 miles. Uh, over here on Diesel, two times OEM or 25,000 or one year. And now it's time to go ahead and pour her in. Here we go. Crack it open our first quart, our first quart. And this takes 12 quarts. 12 quarts total fill. And there she is. Ah. You can feel the protection already. We're giving John the honors. John's gonna put a quart in. This is his brand new truck, 1200 miles. Beautiful. Let's do it. Ah, look at it go. Look at that. Beautiful. On right here, we're at beautiful Boulder Highway. That's right, uh, 5400 East Tropicana, Boulder and Trop, right next to a Domino's Pizza. So if you're hungry while we're doing your service, go over and grab you a slice. All right, we'll see you guys, thanks. Hey guys, we're all wrapped up in this beauty. I tell you what, this was the hardest filter handlings we've ever done on the channel. Um, it takes one hand, and you really got to get in there, if you will. And uh, you can't go double-handed to get in there to the filter, and uh, you have to stay with it. Um, it took me 24 minutes to remove the filter and put the new filter on between all the handlings, the subtleties, 24-minute uh, filter handling job, technical stuff. My wrists are all worn out. God, rough stuff, but we got 12 quarts in, things purring like a kitten. John was a, a blessing to have on the channel, great guy. We're happy to see him starting a new adventure with a beautiful vehicle that he can tow, plow snow, jump, uh, Dukes of Hazard stuff, everything, he can do it. And uh, that's pretty much it. One more thing, we got our Amsoil giveaway coming up February 23rd. It's gonna be 11 a.m. And that is a live video here on the channel. And we're gonna be giving away all kinds of really cool products, power steering fluid, uh, Amsoil power foam. We're also giving away uh, grease, uh, all purpose. We're also giving away a spray grease and we're giving away a 
diesel clean and seatane boost, which is a new product we just came out with. So if you which guys we tried today, yes, Absolutely. we actually put in the right. diesel all in one today in John's truck. And if you have any questions about any of these products, let me know. And Jeff is always here down here on Boulder Highway, Tropicana. You can come down here, get your oil changed, give Jeff a three day heads up if you want to get your truck done. And uh, that's pretty much it. We will see you guys back next time on synthetic oil protection. Cheers to protection, protection, protection. More protection.